The Colorado Rockies can't seem to find any consistency as the regular season continues to wind down with just 29 games remaining on their schedule. Hey guys, welcome back to the Denver Post Newsroom. I'm Alexis Perry with your Denver Post Sports Minute. In the matinee rubber match Wednesday at Coors Field, Detroit's Justin Verlander made his 380th start and showed his veteran command virtually silencing the Rockies' bats by allowing just three hits and one run in six innings pitched. While he was dominant defensively, he even owned Colorado offensively. And a 13-year RBI dry spell in the top of the first as he scored Jose Iglesias for his first ever ribby. Verlander wasn't the only one driving in runs, unfortunately, as Rockies starter Chad Bettis allowed five earned runs, two taters, and just five innings on the mound. In total, the Tigers managed to put six on the scorecard, while the Rockies tallied just two, one of which was a 424-foot solo shot from Chuck Nasty, who is still the best leadoff hitter in Major League Baseball and has racked up a total of 32 home Home runs from the leadoff spot this season, meaning he only needs eight more to break the record, which I believe he'll do over the final month of the regular season. Today, the boys have a much needed day off to reset and gear up for the Arizona Diamondbacks, who are currently sitting atop the National League wildcard standings. The D-backs are 8-2 and two in their last 10 outings and will hope to continue their winning ways here in Denver. Hopefully, the Rockies will make it a little tougher for them tomorrow. For more from the Denver Post Sports Desk, be sure to follow me on Twitter at Alexis Ray Perry.